So this is what happens. To Burn, it. Burn it. Burn it. Burn it real oh, good. good. Oh yeah. Uh, oh yeah. Set, set it ablaze. Set it ablaze. Let Jimmy know. Let him know. Yo, what's up, Charming Gang? We're gonna be checking out the SMO movie, Brooklyn Guy's Depression. I already know why he's depressed, is because Nuggets have won the finals, and <laughs> Jimmy Butler, Big Butler, didn't get a ring, so yeah, he's pretty depressed. Oh man, I can't wait to watch the Miami Heat win tonight. Go All right, he got himself some Nuggets. Three to one? Well, yes, but that's because Jimmy Butler wants a challenge. You see, because the only team to come back from a three to one deficit was LeBron James, and Jimmy Butler wants to outdo him. Didn't I say Boy, Nuggets in five? What would happen if they were to lose? They're not like, gonna lose. In here. the last you know reaction? Because you can't spell heat without eat, which is what Jimmy Butler's gonna do to those Nuggets, just like I'm gonna do to these Nuggets. <laughs> oh, that's nom, 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 that's nom, why he got nuggets some Nuggets. <laughs> not these Nuggets. These Nuggets are delicious. I mean, the Denver Nuggets suck. Hey, Karen, guess what? It's Grimace's birthday today. What? You know, Doesn't Grimace, he have like a shake? Friend, today's his birthday. He has oh, like a purple oh, shake. What? Yeah, it's his birthday, and you know what he wanted for his birthday? What he Boy, wanted? To win. I don't think that's I don't what he wanted. Boy, I think you're lying. No, no he probably wanted lipo. And Grimace are friends. We talk all the time. Oh, big ass. Fact, that's he probably why he gave me his birthday. He probably wanted to big his back. Oh, Ew, that. No, because you doubted the heat. Because we are gonna win. Tonight. That looks like it tastes like crayons. He's gonna beat those nuggets. He's gonna eat them up. It's probably good though, but it looks like it tastes like crayons. Oh, they lost. Poor guy. Oh, he's so sad. Did they hurt your belly? Well, who won your basketball game, Boiny? The Nuggets. Oh my God, the Heat lost. Heat lost. Why you sad? Clearly. Karen, if we had lost together as a team, I wouldn't be sad. I'd say, well, we tried. Oh, why is he sad? Because Jimmy Butler decided to choke the biggest, fattest, girthiest, veiniest dick. Boiny. Girthy. He did, Karen. He did it right I mean, there. Colorful right language. They even caught it on video. You want to see? I, I want to see it. it. It's pretty graphic, so shield your eyes. All right, guys. So Jimmy Butler. Not safe for work. One. He's right under the goal. We just mm. need a two-pointer. Mm. And then all of a sudden, he goes, here you go, other team. Oh, you gosh. Take the ball. Maybe you'll know what to do with it. <laughs> well, he did, Karen. You saw it. Boy, oh. He didn't cost him the whole game. No, you're right, Karen. It wasn't just that one play. It was also this one. Did he poop see, another play? Down by three. We just need a three to tie it. I don't know why the fuck they put Aww. the ball in Jimmy's come, hands. Come on, but come on, big butt. Jimmy says maybe <laughs> if I throw the ball as fast as I can in the general direction of the goal while I'm covered and there's somebody right in my face, nope. I can get back to <laughs> sucking throbbing veiny giant. Boy, cut it out. Well, Karen, you saw the play. He's Boy, really upset. They next year. No, they don't, Karen. We weren't even supposed to be here this year. We just got lucky. But what about him? And me? Him? Him? Hemi. He cost us the game. Hemi should have just stayed his ass on the bench. We were doing better without him. Pointy, you don't mean that. You love him. Loved. Past tense. I hate Damn, him. Damn, he's really but heartbroken over this. Do you joy? You say you want to marry him. Yeah, well, now Whoa, I want to marry him. Oh, pause. Yeah. What do I do? I'm him, can you? <laughs> Pointy, I think you just need to go lie down. Yeah, I'm going to go lie down on the railroad tracks in front of a train so I get run over. This is how sport fans really <laughs> act when their team loses. Go take a shower. I've been wearing this garbage bag all night. I probably like shit, cause Jimmy was playing like shit. Are you fucking kidding me, Jimmy? That is a true sports fan when they really take it to heart whenever their team loses. Like, I like watching sports, but it never really affects me if my team loses. Like, you know, I'm still gonna wake up the next day. I'm still gonna be, you know, doing my thing. It's like he damn near like put all the money he has to his name on this game and he lost it. That's how he's reacting. But he's just a true sports fan. He really believed in Hemi Butler, Big Butt, and you know, Big Butt failed him. Pause. Damn, bro. Boy, you're gonna have to turn the water on. You are depressed. No, I don't. My tears will be the water. Boy, it's just a game. No, oh, that wasn't even a game. That was just hand the ball to the Denver Nuggets so they can score <laughs> and win and get their rings while Jimmy claps for them and hands them their trophy and don't forget he sucked them all off. Boy, don't like that again. Take a jersey off. He it's is so wet. miserable. Take it off. It's melted to my body from the heat of that giant steaming shit pile that Jimmy left out on the court. You know, I didn't even know he was that backed up. It's probably from all the coffee. What? <laughs> I told you about the coffee yet. Coffee? No, Bonnie, you're talking nonsense. You're like, Take a shower and get out. Okay. Coffee makes people hey, poop, Bonnie, right? I know what'll make you feel. Oh, she's trying, trying to get trying to get freaky. The coffee thing. So Jimmy has his own coffee company called Big Face Coffee, and he wants to be the biggest coffee brand in the world. Well, that's not gonna beat Starbucks, Boiny. I love 
them. Yeah, maybe he should focus on playing basketball. You know, because he's a basketball he's trying, player. He's trying to maybe be a barista. If you win a goddamn championship, <laughs> people will want to drink your coffee, Jimmy. He's I'm trying to make frappuccinos. Say, hmm, I'm drinking NBA champion Jimmy Butler's coffee. Doesn't that sound better than I'm drinking NBA loser Jimmy Butler's coffee? You can't even beat nuggets, Jimmy. How you expect to beat frappuccinos? Pumpkin spice? Pumpkin spice with sweet bus. Okay, boy. Calm <laughs> down. Let's just get some sleep. He don't even want to fool around. That's how mad he is. Straight. Boydy. No, no, I'm just trying to do the math. Do the math here with me, Karen. Let me figure this out. I don't want to do the math, Boydy. No, 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 we're going to figure this out. Tell me why on game day he He's too pissed to, play cards to fool around. Drinking coffee instead of going down to the court at 5 o'clock in the morning and shooting some hoops. You know, that's Kobe shit, but not Jimmy Butler. No, Ugh. he wants to drink as much coffee as he can. R.I.P. Kobe, so man. He big IBM uh. shit during the game. <laughs> Boydy, if you're not going to bed, leave the room because I'm tired. Yo, if you turn down fooling around with a girl or, you know, whoever you're interested in because you're mad, that's how you know you have grown as a man. Do you know how hard it is to turn down fooling around? You know, granted you like the person, you know, it's easy to turn down a linebacker or, you know, Lizzo. But like, if you actually like the person, it's kind of hard to turn it down. But when you become a man, you start to realize there's bigger things or more important things, man. My, my feelings matter. Ugh. You know who's not tired? Jimmy Butler, because he's been drinking coffee all day and he didn't use up that energy on the court. So, hmm, I wonder where all that energy's going. Oh, I know. I bet he's going to use all that energy to suck big, fat, girthy. Good night, Boyne. He really on this girthy <laughs> D. Jeez. <I'm> <laughs> You're just going to get more depressed watching replays. Come on, man. I could do that. Pay me $100 million. To go ahead and finish your and grimace shake. Drink coffee and play cards with my buddies. Hey, Dad. Oh, oh. Don't look, Penelope. You're not old enough. Daddy's watching an adult movie. No, you're not. You're just watching basketball. <laughs> no, I'm watching Naughty Coffee Barista takes on burly five-man basketball. <laughs> what are you talking about? Oh, you don't That's a that grown very doing all interesting the metal, metal title. Team? Um, missing a bunch of basketball shots? Oh, yeah, he's doing a lot of that, but where is his mouth? What? Well, you see, Penelope, when two basketball players love each other very much, they suck each other off, and Jimmy must love the Nuggets because he's the only one sucking. Imagine Ew, if Jimmy that? watches this. Don't get me my wife. <laughs> That'd be what? funny. Don't give me my goddamn lighter and a pen and some lighter fluid. What? Are you about to burn your jersey? Okay. Are you about to burn your jersey? Dad, why did you He's want burning to his jersey. I'm burning my jersey. Don't you think you're taking Don't this basketball this. game a little too seriously? <laughs> hey, well, at least somebody's taking it seriously because Jimmy sure didn't. He thought that was practice. He thinks the game's tomorrow. Is it? No, it was tonight, <laughs> and they lost because Jimmy thought it was opposite uh. game. He thought the team with the least points won. He thought he was playing golf. Oh, so he lost? All right, Penelope screw it. Let's, let's burn it. Fine. Yeah, piss uh, off, Penelope. This jersey. She probably called basketball sh shooty basketball. hoops. No, he yeah, burn it. Ball. So this is what happens. To Burn, it. Burn it. Burn it. Burn it real good. good. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Set, set it ablaze. Set it ablaze. Let Jimmy know. Let him know. Is he gonna like set the house on fire? The fire alarm's going off. Oh my god. Whoa wee. Oh my god. What the hell is wrong with him? What the hell were you thinking, boy? He's starting a fire. Well, at least some heat showed up today. That's not funny, <laughs> Boyne. You were on the bus. <laughs> that was kind of funny. I didn't say it was funny. It's kind of funny. funny. Cut the crap, Boyne, and take your sad eyes off. Oh, I'm afraid the sad eyes are going to stay. For how long? For a very long time, until Jimmy Butler wins a championship. Boyne, Ooh, that could be forever. Happen. Oh, it won't. Believe me, I know <laughs> it won't. Boyne, why don't you become like a Brooklyn Nets fan? You know, because of your name, Brooklyn T guy. Wait, you know my name? Then why do you always call me Boyne? I thought you didn't know my name. I thought that was like a nickname. I call you Boyne, Boyne. I call you Boyne. Why don't you call me Brooklyn? Because that's my name. I Boyne. I'm calling you Boyne. Right? <laughs> okay, well, I'm not going to be a Brooklyn Nets fan. Who am I going to be? Boyne. Seth Curry, the lesser of the Currys. The other <laughs> one. He's the brother of Steph Curry. And I guess if you say his name fast enough, it sounds like that. I think Seth you got and that Steph. Wrong, Boyne. Stephanie's a girl's name. Well, look, I'm not going to be a Brooklyn Nets fan. Well, Boyne, why don't you go back to work? Get hey, be a, be a Mavericks yeah, fan. That's an idea. Come Everybody on. Everybody should do what they're paid to do because it's their job and not just throw it all away so that they can make coffee. Okay. Have you even tried this coffee, Boyne? You're, you're kind of getting really toxic. To buy it. Miami? Oh, that would make sense. Well, maybe if he won a championship, people would know where to buy his coffee. 
But yes, you're right. Maybe I'll try to go to work. Something that gets me out of the dumps whenever I'm feeling bad is completely blowing off all of my responsibilities, work, whatever I have to do, hanging out with friends, just completely blow it all off. Then I get my uh, blender, put some ice in it, uh, you know, put a little tequila, and then put some margarita mix in it, blend it up, sit on the couch, put on Netflix, drink my sorrows away. But I probably shouldn't uh, recommend you do that. Don't do that. <laughs> Hey, nurse, what do you got for me? Chester Damn, Cheetah Chester! On Cheeto dust again. Oh, man, Chester. I think we should Always get going through it. and try to resuscitate him. Yeah, that sounds cool. Hey, you lost cause. You should just... in the break room. Doctor, I'm I dying. think we should focus on the patient. <laughs> yeah, you would think that we should probably do that because that's our jobs and that's what we get paid to do. But I want to try to start a coffee company. Doctor, I think we're losing him. Just try it real quick. Come on, take uh, it. Maybe the coffee is really good. It smells like a crappy cup of coffee. Never Maybe mind. Beat Starbucks. Doctor, I think we lost him. Oh. Well, never mind, though. Wow, he doesn't even care. How <laughs> Well, I did a better job than Jimmy. I Maybe you should have person. He killed called in. every Miami Heat fan. You killed someone today, Bonnie? Yeah, I tried the Jimmy method. I got to work and then started my own coffee company. <laughs> what does that have to do with killing someone? What does it have to do with basketball? He is Aren't so petty. Gatorade or some shit? You know, coffee's a diuretic. He was probably dehydrated as fuck. I've never seen after the Super Bowl people run up and dump a bunch of coffee on their coach and give them third degree burns. He's speaking Boy, facts right now. Alone. Oh, okay. But coffee is coffee. Boy, people love coffee. Doing right now. Not pouting like you. Yeah, of course not. He get paid a hundred million dollars just to drink coffee and give the ball to the other team. What? Ooh, oh, is this gonna be Jimmy Butler? Big Are butt. Are you gonna go get it, Boyney? <laughs> yeah. Go. He ain't going. Oh, sorry, I was giving a Jimmy amount okay, of effort. Okay, he's going. Uh, Hello, Butler. What did you did you did you? Jimmy Butler? What are you doing here? It's Jimmy Butt. Is houses, Big Butt in the house. Well, I came by to explain myself. <laughs> oh, good, because I was really wondering why the hell you played like dog shit tonight. Well, you see, the Denver Nuggets have never won a championship before. But see, the Miami Heat, we've won three. So I felt bad and I let them win. Well, that you blew the game well, you purposely the ball directly to the other team when we were only down by maybe one. this is all in his yeah, head I tried to hide that the best I could but whoops whoops yeah yeah whoops well I mean I guess I understand why you let him win but did you really have to suck him off too <laughs> well, listen, see, I'll try it next season and I'll win it all okay all right that I'm, is gonna hold you to, I'm gonna hold you to yeah, that you promise coffee I would not but I actually really recommend that you take this and drink this instead on game day well no thank you I like my coffee Please, please take this. No, the coffee's good for me. No, I'm literally begging you, Jimmy. No, you hold on to that for me. Maybe practice. Don't try to be getting the, the no, coffee shits. Okay. Coffee okay. makes you poop. I know that for a fact. Mm. You'd be on the Who's toilet. The door, oh, nobody. Just squeezing out turd monkeys. At this time, <laughs> <laughs> what? Turd monkeys. <laughs> was it Jimmy Butler? It was Jimmy. Butler. It was Big Butt. <laughs> <laughs> At least he got to talk to his idol, his favorite basketball player. Or, you know, used to be until he lost that championship game. But he'll get over it. It'll just take some time. Um, you know, sport fans, whenever their team loses, they're upset for a little bit. Then they realize that life goes on and there's other things to worry about. Like, you need to worry about paying your rent, bro. Like, I know you just got laid off. You need to pay your rent. What are you doing? Don't forget to subscribe, like, share this video. Because without further ado, that was it. My name is Prince of Hawkham. Stay charming, my friends.